Good evening and welcome to TL Physics and today I'm going to talk about, I'm going to actually give an example of using de Broglie. So de Broglie is this idea that waves, uh, particles can act like waves. So this is an electron, this is from the last video, an electron going through some carbon atoms and it has a mass here and a velocity of a tenth of the speed of light. And we calculated its wavelength to be 2.43 times 10 to the minus 11. The distance between the two carbon atoms here is 0.154 nanometers. I want to know the angle for the first maxima. So, d sine theta equals n lambda. These carbon atoms are acting like a diffraction grating. This is why it's called electron diffraction. D is the distance between the gaps. I'm going to use this one here. 0.154 times 10 to the minus 9 sine theta. So it's the first maxima, so n will be 1. And the wavelength is going to be this one here. Okay. So sine theta equals 2.43 times 10 to the minus 11 over 0.154 times 10 to the minus 9 and that equals so 2.43 times 10 to the minus 11 divided by 0.154 times 10 to the minus 9 is 0.16 and sine to the minus 1 of 0.16 equals an angle of approximately 9.1 degrees that is very noticeable. 10 degrees is a very noticeable angle. In exam questions before, they have asked you to prove the angle and to say if it would be noticeable. 10 degrees is a very noticeable deflection. And that is an example of using diffraction grating equations with particle physics. <laughs>